सो हे गायज वेलकम बैक टू मोर संस्कृत फ्राइडेज एंड टुडे आई एम गोट टॉक अबाउट द फाइव थिंग्स डेट आई वॉन्ट फ्रॉम संस्कृत एम्पायर नाउ संस्कृत एम्पायर इज अ न्यू लीक संस्कृत गेम इट वॉज लीक ऑन कोटैकू आई एम सॉरी फॉर द लेट इन्फॉर्मेशन बिकॉज दिस वॉज आई थिंक लीक एट द बिगिनिंग ऑफ द ईयर आई थिंक एंड इट्स बिन क्वेट अ वाइव सो आई एम गोट बी counting down five things that i want from the game so let's do this so the one thing that i really want from sanskrit empire is a great modern day storyline now the modern day storyline was pretty much good around sanskrit 3 but it got more confusing around assassin's creed uh, around when uh, from sanskrit 4 black flag and after that like you just walk around the office and shit and then now the modern day story is more linear more of you can say side story or some something i don't really like that they must really focus on the modern day story more and uh, explain like what the hell is going on because i'm so confused for what the hell is going on in the modern day because in syndicate i think they got it a little bit clear of what is going on exactly but still, still it wasn't fully cleared that what is exactly happening so yeah rave want that and uh, will be great if you implement that because so far in the modern story i know that like juno is kind of the bad uh, villain i think who is trying to take over the world and stuff and uh, we have to stop it like uh, the assassins and the assassins have to stop it and maybe they can be do it like this that the assassins and templars join each other to stop juno to control the world so assassins and templars unite so that would be pretty cool thing to see in the sanskrit empire but i don't even know if this will happen or not but i really want a great modern day story not like the sanskrit for whatever where you walk in in office or whatever and you just go to the animus and sink your ancestors memories i don't like that and they want a great modern day story so the other thing that i really want from assassin's creed is a great combat system now the combat in assassin's creed i didn't really i am such a huge fan of the combat but it's pretty not really that good and unrealistic i don't really like it too much in syndicate also it was more you know harder but still i want the combat to be better just if uh, one of the pe- people say that developers at ubisoft say that the game will have more of a witcher 3 feel so that pretty much uh says that most likely it'll be like rpg something like that and you get to like fight and all that the witcher 3 combat now not i have not played any witcher 3 games witcher games but the witcher 3 combat was pretty good and i really liked it and uh, if they implement this in the sanskrit empire then maybe it can be good i don't really know but i really want a great combat system now the another thing that i want from sanskrit empire is a great setting which basically mean egypt and uh, egypt is actually a pretty great setting i haven't been there but of course egypt is beautiful but really like if they focus on the egypt and the cities then maybe they can you know make us feel that we are really in Egypt and exploring around and all that shit and you must really do that in a science creed uh, two or brotherhood i think there was a feature if you, you that you can actually drive boats not exactly boats but row boats so yeah i actually really like that and uh, if they implement this in the science creed empire so it will be pretty good even camels and horses and all that And I would really love love it if they implement that. And even like, it's also leaked in Kotaku is that the game will also have a naval kind of system. So we most likely will have naval in it, but no naval combat will be there. So that's I don't even know because the naval combat uh, never made me feel like more of an Assassin's Creed game. It just made me feel more like pirate, a pirate game in a Assassin's Creed for Black Flag. I didn't really like it too much, but it was not okay. I think, but really, uh, 
I also said that the game will be three times bigger than the map, three times bigger than Black Flag, and uh, it is really great to hear that it's three times bigger than Black Flag because really then the, we will have more places to explore, more stuff to find out, and more side quests and all that, and like exploring and all that, the cities and everything. And I would really love that if they implement a really like make the game huge and uh, yeah the, I really want a big setting a nice setting for Sanskrit Empire now the another thing that I would want from Sanskrit Empire is basically the better missions you know like the mission of Sanskrit were pretty good and uh, the mission structures were pretty good I like them but sometimes like the tailing missions and all that would really made me frustrated and all that I really wish you don't implement tailing missions in a Sanskrit Empire but they must really have you know good missions in a couple in a couple of days ago I think Ubisoft actually uh, sent kind of a message that uh, like how does the Sanskrit economics work like how the mission structures how does the cool the you know like the money what do you call it I don't know the uh, stores and all that where you get to buy all the stuff customize your character and all that like if it works perfectly I think it works perfectly but you must include a lot of new features and I would really love that you can you know just select your own costumes and all that like you know, make your own, you know, Sanskrit armor or whatever. That would be really cool. And yeah, basically like more of RPG feel to it. The missions and everything. I would really love that if they do this. And yeah, it'll be pretty great if uh, they give the game more, you know, an RPG element. I would really, lo I really like RPG games. I like seriously. And yeah, I would really love better missions and yeah so another thing that i would uh, want from sanskrit empire is a better multiplayer well multiplayer in sanskrit uh, is not really that great and it's not worth playing you know like why you worth waste your time in multiplayer while the single player is much better than the multiplayer but i really would like a new multiplayer mode in which you can you know ex like uh, not exactly a multiplayer but most of a co-op whatever multiplayer or co-op but i want the co-op or multiplayer to be good like gta 5 online or like gta online i think in which you like get to you know um travel around los santos and all that and for that same you can you know uh, with your friends you can you know kind of uh, roam around uh, egypt doing co-op missions and quests and all that that would be really cool if they do that but really like you know making like because multiplayer making multiplayer is also pretty hard like it'll take a lot of time to do all the co-op and everything because gta 5 actually have had a lot of time uh, in development it had at least four to five years i think and yeah but empire is only getting around i guess three uh two to three years so yeah but really if they implement that it will be really great and yeah so guys those are the things that i want from a sanskrit empire um uh, a sanskrit empire can be a really great game if you saw focus on it too much and uh, you know focus on all the the things that the previous games didn't really achieve but really like those are the things that i would want from a sanskrit empire and yeah like and subscribe and keep watching i'll see you guys later you got jukes man shit got him